I have a couple of um, complex and intricate implants that needed to be done and obviously with work of that nature I I wanted to make absolutely sure that I that I went to the very best sought out the very very best the way I make decisions is obviously trying to collect as much information as I possibly can and then make the best decision we can with the information that's available at the time and in this particular case I really appreciated Dr. Pick's willingness to share with me every detail uh, in which I was interested. To create that partnership with me um, uh, also helps me to address the emotional side of this decision. This is not just about are Dr. Pick and his team capable of, of executing this intricate procedure, but it's really very much of an emotional decision. How am I gonna look? How am I gonna feel? What about pain? What are the long-term effects? At a surface level or at a deeper level, these are emotional decisions. And the more Dr. Pick shared with me, the more he was able to address some of my emotional decisions. There's that personal touch, there's that empathy, which says to me, we care, uh, we're listening, we're here, we're available, and we're in this together. It's not necessarily just about credentials and it's not just about accreditation. It's really about understanding and being willing to listen and really understanding and approaching each patient with the compassion and creating that patient experience that, that's so memorable that you would never in a million years want to go anywhere else. Why, why would you want to go anywhere else? And so for me with Bob, it has always been the balance. The balance and understanding that, yeah, it is about capability and it is about credentials and it is about experience, but there are a lot of very capable, very experienced uh, periodontists out there, but they're not Dr. Pick. They're not Dr. Pick, and that's the difference.